hello friends welcome to testing shala youtube channel in this video you will learn about how to write the test cases for calculator functionality so you will be learning in detail what all the test cases you may need to require you may require to write for calculator functionality before moving further if you have visited testing shala youtube channel for the first time then please click on subscribe and bell notification so that all our future videos related to software testing will be in your inbox that would help you to enhance your software testing skills let us understand now what are the test cases which we can write for calculator functionality the first test case you should validate or whatever the different types of modes the calculator functionality is going to support then based on that requirement you should write a test case whether it operates in a normal mode or a scientific mode the second is you should also ensure that to validate whatever the screen available which is an lcd screen lcd black screen which is there in the calculator we will have to validate whether using that display screen everything is clearly visible or not whether all the digit all the numbers all the special characters everything is visible properly or not that you should validate as part of the second test the third test case would be you should verify all the functional keys available in the calculator the functional keys could be clear button which is c then save button which is memory m plus delete there are so many functional keys available on the calculator we should verify each and every key function whether it performs its functionality as expected or not that is the third test case you should write for calculator functionality the fourth one is you should validate all the numbers whenever you type any numbers then appropriate number should display in the screen plus whatever the mathematical operations which you are going to do it for the numbers such as add subtract multiplication division or any operation which you are going to perform for these numbers then appropriate functionality should work as expected that is the fourth important test cases for the calculator function then the fifth important function is this is very crucial whenever you switch on the calculator or switch off the calculator whenever switch off the calculator it should turn down whenever switch on the calculator it switch on very easily this is the fifth test case the sixth test case would be your battery consumption test especially when you are using uh, the calculator you should validate the battery part if there is uh, no battery then calculator should not work if battery is there how long uh, the calculator can run with the given battery just to ensure that whether it makes use of uh, all the parameter properly or not or it is uh, draining the battery very faster manner or not these are the six important test scenarios or test cases which you can write for calculator functionality i hope you are able to clearly understood all these six test cases for calculator functionality hope you like this video if you like this video please click on like button and if you have visited testing shala youtube channel for the first time then do click on subscribe button and bell notification so that all our future videos related to, to software testing will be in your inbox that would help you to enhance your software testing skills thanks for watching this video bye for now take care